In order to start your texture mod, the first thing you want to do is download Dat Texture Wizard. The link to this website is going to be in the description. Just click it right here, download it. Once you've got that downloaded, you want to extract the folder, put it wherever you'd like. I put it on the desktop and here I've already got it opened. And then before you start modding your game, I highly recommend making a backup ISO of your game. Just in case you mess something up or want to go back to vanilla melee. Right here I have a tutorial ISO which is different from the one I usually use. I also recommend renaming it so you can easily distinguish it from your vanilla ISO. Name it something like custom melee just to keep everything organized. And then get back to actually using the program. So open texture wizard, go to file, open disk, and then find ISO, double click it, and boom, you'll see all of your game files. And it labels a lot of things for you, so you don't have to do a bunch of like mindless searching to find what you want to hack. If you want to simply download and use pre-made texture hacks, or hacks, skip to the time on screen. Or if you want to make your own, just keep watching the video. For this example, I'll be modifying Randall from the Yoshi story map. So we want to scroll down to the stage files folder, open that up by clicking the little plus, find Yoshi's story, double click it, and you can see all the files from the stage. Here we want to replace Randall, so we have the textures right here, so select them all, right click, export selected textures, and then choose where you want to export them. I already did that, so I can close out of that, and then you have PNG images of all of the textures. Then what you want to do is open that in a photo editing program like Photoshop, like I did here, and you can edit them. And if you're having any issues, like it won't let you edit them in Photoshop, you want to go to Image, Mode, and select RGB. It's not the case with the Randall texture, it already is defaulted like that, but some aren't, and just a heads up. Using the power of editing, I have already edited the Randall textures to be Comedy Genius Poggers Man. Then you want to go to File, Save As, and just save it as the original file name. It's okay to... Actually, no, you want to overwrite the original textures in order to like keep the same file name, because that'll make organization a lot easier later on. So once you've saved those as the original file names, you want to go back to the Texture Wizard, Find each one and make a note of the name right here because that's the same as the file name. Right click it, import textures. So the one we want is 0xc0500. So we go to our new uh, hack textures and this one is 0500. So you want to override it with that and double click it and it should load in and do that with the rest. The C0D00. and then C1500. Uh, and so we've replaced all the textures, and just to save all your changes, go to File, Save, so it should say Save Successful, and then to test out your hack and see if everything worked, open Dolphin, I can spell that right, open Give it. That's fine. I don't care. Don't care. Versus mode, melee. Select over characters, don't care. Load into Yoshi's story and let's see if it worked. And boom! Sorry for my shitty movement, I don't really care right now, but boom, Randall Pog, it worked. Alright, this is the second part of the tutorial if you just want to download other people's texture hacks they've made and put them on your copy of Melee. There's a bunch on this thread, but you can also find some at modulus.net. Keep things simple, I'm just going to use one from here. Let's see here. Get a fox one, since everybody loves fox. And make note of the, like, alt you're taking it from. So it's original, orange, lavender, green, and that's the one you want to replace it with. I'm just going to take one from original. It should load previews. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Um. This is disgusting. 
Okay, trainee corpse. Who doesn't love Attack on Titan? So you want to download that. Open the RAR file and extract it. I've already done that. We've got it right here. So go back to the texture wizard. Um, find the file. Now it's going to be under the characters. So pl.dat. Open that. Go to the character you want. We want Fox. We want to replace his neutral cost. So right click. Import file. Find the one we want. It's in the tutorial folder. It's this file. Double click the dat file. And it'll say ready to be replaced. And then go file. Save. And then it'll turn green and that means it worked. Reopen Dolphin, open the game. Neutral Fox and I guess against a beach. And we have our custom fox. If he's not getting beat up. Boom! That's how you do custom textures in Melee. This is the Modulus site I mentioned earlier that has a bunch of cool custom textures you can download and use. And if y'all have any questions, let me know in the comments below, and I'll try to address as many as I can. And if there's enough, I might make a sequel video. Have a good one.